Sir, there's been an incident. An incident? Uh, a crash, sir. And the subject is missing. Why are you coming to me for instructions? Obviously, I'm going to tell you to find it. It's the most powerful weapon in the universe. Spaghetti! Sp spaghetti in my m m my head! You think? <laughs> wow! What a crazy dream! Oh, good thing dreams are stupid and don't mean anything! You're awake! Perfect. That'll be a lot easier than carrying you out. Huh? What will be easier than carrying me out? This. Get out! What? Your insurance doesn't cover head injury, mister. Get out! Head injury? What? What happened to my head? Hey, hey, quit shoving! Oh, will you just tell me what happened to my head? Hey, 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 easy on the buns! Ah, this bandage is all kinds of itchy. I should just tell it to him straight. Oh, this can't be happening. Ouch! <laughs> Careful, man. I'll bet you. I'm going to do it right so on the map. So shiny. Become a so ship, they said. So shiny. Hey, I can't do it without it. Holy crap. Ooh, what the hell? Okay. Okay. I'm hallucinating. Arms don't grow out of heads. I just gotta get home and sleep this off. It, it's all a hallucination, that, that's all. It's uh, just a hallucination that lets me read minds. Hey, listen, do me a favor. I kinda didn't think this through. Obviously. And I left the handbrake on in the car. Could you disengage it for me? Uh, actually, maybe you can do me a favor instead. I'm looking for a cab ride home, and... I got my own problems here. Problems I do not want to talk about. Listen, thanks for nothing. I'm just gonna wait here till somebody else comes and disengages my car. Peace! Maybe... I... Barbara, if only you hadn't left me for that mafia done with the mad nutty smile. If only my own smile had that sparkle that drives you wild. If only I could take back years of poor dental hygiene. If only I could have you back. I gotta find a way to help this dude get his lady friend back. Keep it up, Barbara. We'll win this competition for sure. Especially since my biggest challenger had an... Unfortunate accident? What? Huh? What was that? Sorry, I was kind of lost in your teeth there. I just love your smile, Don. Uh, Don's my physician, not my n uh, You know what, uh, Don's fine. Honey, I don't care what you're called, as long as you keep showing me those sparkly teeth. Me. Can't stop this dance train. Can't stop this. Some might say that murdering a man to win a dance competition is sociopathic. But is it really sociopathic to only see people as obstacles to be overcome by any means possible? Uh, wait, maybe it is. Maybe that's actually the textbook symptom of sociopathy. Oh well. Do they know? Some might. I am an adult human, and my major criteria in selecting a mate is how shiny their teeth are. I may have made some bad decisions somewhere. However, on the other hand, ooh, shiny teeth. Ed, where are you? We've been practicing for weeks, and you promised you wouldn't stand me up. Don't do this to me, Eddie. Uh, 
chicken. Chicken? I'm nature's greatest predator, buddy, and I'm tired of chicken. I got a taste for special treats, and I ain't coming out for anything except human limbs, baby. Delicious human limbs, so long and crunchy, so full of valuable vitamins and minerals. Bitey! Poor Bitey. All alone and lost in the sewer. Nobody to tuck him in at night. Nobody to give him his belly rubs and his teeth scratches. But he's such a gentle soul. He needs me to take care of him. Chicken, come get it, buddy. <laughs> this can't be real, can it? I thought we'd be together forever. Forever! Oh, I can't believe our relationship is over! I hate to see him hurt, but it had to be done, right? It had to be done! Breakups suck, but I still care for him. I just wish everything didn't have to be so sucky. <laughs> what a kind and noble heart. Here breaks. <laughs> this food is almost ready, but it needs one more spice. But what? Something that tastes of despair. Something that is condensed, liquefied sorrow. Where can I find this ingredient? <laughs> Ah, la ingredient parfait! This meal, it is. Ah, perfection! Perfection! You can really taste this sorrow. Delicious! Mighty! You came back! Come on, let me hug you for a bit. Laura and the kids will be ecstatic to see you again. They may show it by screaming at us and running away, but that's just their way. I feel empty inside. Inside my mouth, anyway. the big idea. Get any closer and I'll get my brother. Typical. I have to do the hard labor while my big brother stands around and smokes. Hooray! You got born ten seconds earlier. That definitely means you have to never work a day in your life. Oh yes, absolutely. I deserve to be the guy mixing the concrete. Heck, if I didn't want to do that, I would have pushed my way to the front line 30 years ago, right? <laughs> it's good to be the big brother. Few months old at the time. Oh gosh, Rachel's gonna kill me if I don't make it to the disco competition on time. Only she won't, because I'll already be dead. Because these guys are gonna kill me real soon. This is it, Ed. You're going to be dead soon, and you never went skydiving. You never ate caviar, and you never beat the Silver Surfer game for the NES. You're gonna die with regrets, Edo. Oh, if only I'd spent more time learning how to escape from trunks instead of learning the enemy attack patterns in the Silver Surfer for the NES. Although, honestly, I'm glad I spent so much time playing Silver Surfer for the NES. That game was tight. No, when I first... Why, as soon as little Mario could walk, he'd be over every day to say hi to Beatrice. And he, and he was always so excited to see him. He'd bark and bark and bark. Just, just endless, frantic barking from Beatrice. <laughs> yes, sir. I never forget a smell. 
Those are the jerks that tortured me every day when I was a puppy. Ah! They tied firecrackers to my tail. Gosh darn it! I'd eat them alive if only I had my teeth. I need teeth, darn it! Beatrice? Is that Beatrice? Where did you get those teeth? Good doggy. Good doggy. Carry me, Luigi. Carry me down. Nice. And it's not too late for the competition. How can I ever say thanks? Well, I, I could use a drive. I've got it. I'll dance for you, and then we can talk about Silver Surfer. Uh, for the NES? Aw, oh, man, I really want to talk about this, but I'm late. Ed, you made it! Where were you? Locked in a trunk, but this stranger wandered in and helped me out. Oh, it's been a good day for that, I think. Let's dance. An amazing set! First place goes to... Rachel and Ed! For their routine, Rachel's Education in Dance! This is an outrage! I paid good money to ensure my victory! Ugh, I'm so angry, I could swallow my teeth! I could literally swallow my teeth! <laughs> I'll save you, Don! I'll save you, Don's teeth! Sleeping with the fishes isn't so bad. It's a great way for me to catch up on my sleep. Ooh, and on my fish watching. You got it. Man, I charged Mario and Luigi one little convenience fee for ordering their concert tickets online. And this is how I end up. Dang. These teeth are so. Sparkly! They feel good! They feel... right! What am I doing here? I need to go show Barbara! Barbara! I'm back! And I got a mouthful to say to you! Bernie? Is that you? You're so... sparkly. Oh, Bernie. Where did we go wrong? We didn't, Barbara. Just forget it. Everything up to now is non-canon. Canonicity starts right now. Hey, thanks for the ride home, Bernie. Thanks for reminding me what's really important. Love. Sparkly teeth. Finally, I'm just a few jumps away from home where I can put all these holy... Aline, I'm home. I've had the craziest day, honey. Uh, check it out. Think of a number between negative gazillion and infinity plus three. I bet you 50 bucks I can read your mind. <laughs> 